I love getting to do this. It's a great job. It's my favorite thing I've ever gotten to do. I worked on a lot of jobs that I didn't really like. It's the first job I've ever had that I really liked. Uh, I worked at Home Depot for a while. Anybody do that? Anybody working on like a high school job? Are you home? Wearing your little apron. Got your little Sharpie name on there. There you go. Ask me. I know. And I didn't know. <laughs> but every day somebody would come into Home Depot. I was there for two and a half years. It's a sad place. And every day somebody would come in holding some piece of a, like some kind of a part, like a bolt or a wire or like a, some kind of a plumbing part. They'd be holding it in their hand. They'd be like, hey, uh, where would a man find one of these? I'd be like, you got one right there. <laughs> I'd go on break, so it's no good. <laughs> I worked at a church for a while. I actually was on staff. I was a young adults pastor at a church, college pastor. That was a great job. I like doing that, man. And we still volunteer at my church. We actually work uh, now. I, I'm, I'm gone a lot, so uh, we're back home. I actually was back home a couple Sundays ago, though. And this is interesting because I, I miss a lot of Sundays from my church because I'm traveling, doing events like this. But I was home a couple Sundays ago. And since this last year, even though that first song was definitely a true story, but since last year, I've lost about 40 pounds. Let me say that. So that's pretty, I'm still working on it. I'm still working on it. Thank you. But then I go to my home church and my, one, of the, one of the deacons is in the back. He's like, Johnny, man, I hadn't seen you in a while. You look different, man. What's going on? I go, well, I've lost 40 pounds since last time you saw me. He goes, oh, you know what? Now that you mention it, I can really tell in your face. <laughs> 40, how fat was my face, you guys? <laughs> what am I, Dora the Explorer? Stop it. Oh, stop it. She's got a big head. But that's the thing, so, uh, but we volunteer, we still volunteer at the church some now, even though I'm not on staff at the church anymore. We work in the nursery. I like working with the babies, man. It's fun. And I like working with the babies. My wife and I, we work with the babies because they can't tell on you if it all goes wrong. That's what's great about it. You know, there's no way. If I hand you back a crying baby as a parent, it's like, look, I don't know. Maybe I dropped him. Maybe he's a brat. There you go. <laughs> But we were repainting in our church, you know, which is pretty cool. We were remodeling the whole church. And so we were putting scriptures on the wall, different scriptures that went along with that department. So like the, the, the elementary department and the young adults, they were, or the young, uh, the middle schoolers, they were like, raise up a child in the way he should go. And when he is old, he will not depart from it. That was the scripture they chose. And I chose for the nursery, for the babies, I chose 1 Corinthians 15, 51, which if you don't know what that says, it says, behold, I reveal to you a mystery. We shall not all sleep but we shall all be changed. And I thought, 